Hi guys, I'm going to show you today um, what's a very a very handy app for, uh, I suppose you could say, debugging what's causing your battery to drain. Um, obviously, when your screen's on and you're using your device, battery's going to use quite a, uh, it's going to burn quite a bit because of the screen and just because you're using it, the processor's running faster. That's to be expected. There's a, not a great deal you can do about that. You can dim the screen, you can do various bits and pieces, but for me, the more important time. Is when the phone's off you know you would expect it not to be using too much battery but obviously there are a lot of things that are still going on within the phone depending obviously what apps you have installed so and where people that do have a lot of apps installed when I say a lot I'm talking sort of 100 200 some people maybe only have 10 or 20 and probably have fantastic battery life but other people a bit like myself might have 100 or so apps and just one of them can be can be doing too much basically while your screen's off and can be burning away at the battery and this app, Better Battery Stats, helps you see what's uh, what's doing that. So, at the top, I've got some different drop down options: kernel weight loss, partial weight loss, alarms, network, CPU states, process. Now, I'm only really showing you here about the kernel, sorry, the partial weight loss. That's effectively saying when your phone should be asleep, or has been asleep maybe, one or two, um, what is it that's kind of waking it up? So it's not waking up to the point that the screen's coming on and it's doing things, that's why it's called a partial weight lock, I believe, um, in, but it's keeping things active within your phone. You then get different options of, well, since when? Since boot, since unplugged, since charged, since screen off, so I mean, I'm generally just going since charged, that's fine. And the current ones. So we then get a list. And you can see there, so basically Google Plus has kept my phone, I've only been on to say, yeah, since one hour, 52 minutes, I've lost 13% battery. Um, that's 6.9% an hour, if you can see that at the top there. That's relatively high, but then I did, I have been using it quite a bit in the first uh, couple of hours today. I've been laying in bed reading Twitter and stuff like that. Um, so I won't see, even though, let's, for example, I've been using Twitter for... 20 minutes, half an hour, or something like that. You don't see that in this list because they're not partial wake locks. That's I'm actually using the phone. You might see them in the battery stats that you get when you go to to settings. So this is just when the phone should be idle. What's keeping it awake? In this case, Google Plus has kept it awake. Um, audio out. I was listening to Beyond Pod, and so you can see that's the next one. So even though the screen was off, so seven minutes forty-four seconds or seven minutes fifty. It playing things was keeping it awake. Quite a common one next, the network locator. So basically Google Maps, just trying to see where you are. Gmail. So for me, Google Talk, it's all fairly normal stuff that I would expect to see keeping my phone awake when it's trying to sleep. We're down to sort of two seconds, look, two seconds for NFC. So, and face detection service, one second. So these kind of things, they don't really worry you. You want to just be keeping an eye of what's at the very top of this list. If so, if you're really trying to conserve battery, you know, sign out of Google Plus in between using it, um, turn off network locations and things like that. If you really, you know, want it to to last a long time, um, there was somewhere where I mean, I guess processes. No, okay, I've got to be honest. I don't really know. Oh, processes. So that's not actual apps and things. But there is, you know, there's other, other information that you can get. I've got to be honest, I don't know a great deal about the other bits. And normally, um, the partial weight locks is the important one, really. If, if you're moaning about batteries on a forum like SDA or something like that, people will be asking, well, what's what's your top of your partial weight loss list? So, there we go. Um, it's £1.74 to buy from Google Play. You can, if you, if you have a search around on uh, XDA, there is a, an XDA version, a free download. But I would recommend it if you can if you can afford the 174, please do. It is a very handy application. So let's support developers and pay the 174. There you go. My name's Andy. Take care.